Hey foodies, it's good to see you. How often do you eat burgers? Hamburgers, cheeseburgers, double bacon burgers, whatever. If you're not into them, you may be the only one. It's estimated that Americans eat 50 billion burgers each day. That's three burgers a week for every person in the United States. In 2016, the world consumed an estimated 130 billion pounds of beef. Let's discuss what would happen to your body if you ate burgers every day. Do you gain weight? Is your immune system negatively affected? Wait, are there actually health benefits? We're talking all that as well as a few interesting fast food stats. Shall we begin? Let's first talk about what a burger is. I mean, of course, you know what a hamburger is. I'm not trying to be condescending, but what is it actually made of? Wow, what am I saying? Let's just talk about where they come from. While a hamburger remains a staple of North American cuisine, this food phenomenon may have begun in Germany. Like every popular invention, the true nature of its origin is up in the air. But the word hamburger derives from the German city Hamburg. See what I did there? A hamburger normally consists of a grilled beef patty served between two buns. From there, you'd usually add your choice of toppings. These often include vegetables as well as condiments. Now, it's going to be difficult to discuss their nutrition. After all, burgers come in all shapes and sizes. The average single patty burger equals around 279 calories. This includes 21% of your daily intake of saturated fats, 21% of your sodium, and 9% of carbohydrates. If you decide to get a little wild and go for a cheeseburger instead, a single patty cheeseburger is around 319 calories. You're recommended between 2,000 and 2,500 calories per day. While the amount found in ham and cheeseburgers may seem low, you need to remember that these are your basic choices, presumably the kind of burger you'd cook from home. Find this topic interesting? Make sure you subscribe to our channel, hit that like button, and ring the notification bell to stay up to date on our latest bestie content. If you're a regular at fast food restaurants, you'd know that burgers can get a lot bigger and a heck of a lot greasier. Let's refer to our favorite burger joint, McDonald's. A quarter pounder with cheese, or Royale with cheese for our viewers who are film buffs, is equal to around 510 calories. You think that's a meal and a half? It's nothing. The quarter pounder with cheese and bacon carries an extra 100 calories. McDonald's double quarter pounder contains a whopping 720. Speaking of Whoppers, let's take a look at Burger King. You may want to hold on to your seats. If you're watching your diet, let's just say Burger King isn't your ideal dining destination. Their Cheddar Bacon King sandwich is an absolute threat to the human race. The sandwich alone contains 1,200 calories. These include 33 grams of saturated fat, 50 grams of carbs, and oh boy, 1,930 milligrams of sodium. God forbid you have a side of large fries with that order. You'd have to have 911 on speed dial. This all seems pretty extreme, doesn't it? I mean, don't get me wrong. We're not trying to stop you from eating Burger King or Mickey D's. It's not like Wendy's is sliding his money under the table. These burgers are always fun to eat, and to be honest, there are other burgers that are much worse on the calorie scale. Take the Monster Thick Burger from the US food chain Carl's Jr. It's in the neighborhood of 1,340 calories with 3,310 milligrams of sodium. That's more than double the American Heart Association's suggested daily intake. You may be wondering what the point of me mentioning all this is. Well, while fast food is obviously fun to eat, it's dreadfully unhealthy. And people eat there a lot. Some people eat there every day of the week. In 2018, research found that 85 million Americans visit fast food establishments on any day of the week. Between 2013 and 2016, 37% of adults reported consuming fast food each day. If you have an addictive personality, there's normally one vice that you're fixated on over others. If that vice is McDonald's, eating there every day is certainly within the realm of possibility. The restaurant is said to feed 1% of the world's population each day. That's over 68 million people. In the same study, males were more likely to eat fast food for lunch, while women were more likely to have it for a snack. Before we continue, are you a female concerned about the state of your health? Check out our recent video on seven symptoms of strokes in women. Also, if you're looking to improve your diet, you may want to have a look at our latest clip discussing nine food combinations that will benefit your health. Now, back to our discussion on what eating a burger every day will do to your body. So all of this information has brought us back to my original question. What happens to your body when you eat a burger every day? Well, the truth is everybody's body acts differently. It all depends on the state of your health beforehand. 
but the majority of people are going to notice a dramatic change in their well-being, likely for the worst. Roughly 15 minutes after your first bite, the sugar content of your burger will absorb into your bloodstream. This results in a spike in glucose, which can eventually cause insulin resistance. Over time, your body's resistance to insulin can turn into type 2 diabetes. This is definitely something to consider if you've been making daily visits to the McDonald's drive-thru. It can lead to severe oxidative stress on your body's cells. This is something that can be prevented by dropping the burgers and adding a few more veggies to your diet. This is not all daily hamburger consumption can lead to. A study from 2012 focused on a group of healthy men who ate a greasy fast food meal. In the end, they found that their arteries were narrow. Daily consumption of fatty burgers can only make this worse. Eventually, your arteries will clog, obstructing blood flow to the heart. This paves the road to heart attacks or cardiac arrest. A burger's sodium content can also pose a problem. The salt you're taking in from a big, greasy piece of beef can also affect your arteries. Another study found that men who ate 1,000-calorie meals loaded with saturated fat and sodium had their blood filled with fatty acids and triglycerides. Now, let's spice things up a little. Remember how I said people's bodies react in different ways? Well, there are people who have undergone challenges where they're required to eat burgers for a set period of time. In the end, the challenge has little to no effect on their health. In 2012, a 20-year-old man from California decided that he would scarf down a burger every day for a whole month. This was done specifically at U.S. Burger Joint In-N-Out. He made a point to film himself as the challenge progressed. By the end of the challenge, the changes to his health were minimal. The young man reported feeling some fatigue and delirium halfway through, but that seemed to be about it. When he started the challenge, he weighed around 158 pounds. By the end, he weighed 160. While the challenge didn't have as severe of an impact as he thought, he stated that it would probably be a while before he walked through the in-and-out doors again. Not so compelling of an example? All right, let me crank up the intensity. In 2016, a man from Toronto decided to embark on a fast food challenge where he ate one hamburger every day for one whole year. In an interview, the man stated that he decided to go through with the challenge after making a New Year's resolution he was going to join a gym. This way, he could afford to eat the burgers, as he figured he would work off the calories. While a year-long commitment of eating burgers may seem like heaven to some, it's not as easy as an undertaking as we may think. Despite some road bumps, the man completed the challenge. When asked if he was facing any subsequent health problems, he replied that he wasn't. In fact, he actually stated that he was feeling better than he did at the beginning of the challenge. However, this wasn't the product of magic. The man was heavily supported by a daily walk routine of 6 kilometers. He would also eat healthy meals for the majority of the day. Engaging in sporting activities such as hockey and volleyball helped as well. So if you're eating burgers on the regular, try to be as active as possible while also consuming healthier foods. Do you enjoy burgers? Does this video make you want to eat them more or less? Let us know in the comment section below. We'd love to hear from you. Enjoyed this video? Hit like, share, and subscribe to Bestie. Wait! What kind of Bestie would we be if we didn't tell you about our other awesome videos? Go ahead, choose the left or right video and enjoy!